William Williams Keene was born in this house in Philadelphia in 1837. He went to college in Providence, Rhode Island, the only time he lived outside Philadelphia. In 1860, he returned to Philadelphia and enrolled at Jefferson Medical College, beginning what would be a long and eventful career in medicine. Keene specialized in surgery. Here he is in the operating theater at Jefferson. That's him in white standing to the right. In 1887, he performed the first successful surgery for removal of a brain tumor in the United States. When he was asked to assist in the operation on President Cleveland in 1893, Keene was at the pinnacle of his career. By accepting, he put his considerable reputation on the line. Dr. Keene was active well into his 90s. He liked to say that to kill time is murder in the first degree. He died in 1932 at 95. He's buried here in Woodland Cemetery in Philadelphia. This spot is only about three miles from the house where he was born. But in those three miles, Dr. Keene lived a life of achievement and distinction.